everyone, welcome to today's video. I thought I would do another tasting video um, today since I didn't do anything super, super exciting this last week to be able to show you guys. Um, yeah, I decided today I was gonna taste uh, sugar-free gum. There's a lot of weird flavors of sugar-free gum here. Um, it seems like at least most of the gum that I've seen is either like Eclipse, it's super popular here, especially those ones in the little, like, you know, the plastic can thing. There's tons of those. Um, I can't remember, I don't think Orbitz is super um, popular here, but there's all these other brands and other bizarre flavors. So I thought I would try those today. DH is not with me to taste this, he's not super, keen on gum anyways so he decided to opt out of this one but we are putting together kind of like a top favorites of his of weird energy drinks um we should be we'll start working on that in the next few weeks um because he definitely has some opinions about <laughs> the energy drinks here so i am going to go ahead and start i've got pellegrino as a little palate cleanser they only had the ridiculously large bottles at the store. Um, so let's see if I can get through these without blowing my palate out. Um, let's see, what do we have? What do I think I should start with? Um, okay, well, let's start with this, because it's here. This brand is called Biodent. Um, this is eucalyptus flavor. Ooh, it has little, it has braille on the back. That's super cool. Ooh, it is endorsed by the Iranian Dental Association. See on the, the edge there. Um, let's see, it's sweetened with xylitol. Um, yeah, it's supposed to be a long lasting flavor. Let's see if it's any good. Comes in the same type of pack, like, uh, what is that, five gum? Um, the stuff in the States, it's like super good. I think it's five, I don't know really hard to get out. Okay, let's see. Biodent. I think there's something in the States called Biodent, but I think it's not gum. Ooh, it's cute. It's like blue and looks crunchy. Hmm. I'm pretty good. It's um almost spearmint or winter minty, not the green. I guess I taste a little eucalyptus. It's really nice though. It's like a nice, refreshing. Yeah, it's not super long lasting. It's totally gonna lose its flavor in a minute, but well, yeah, it's good. Yeah, I like that a lot. I wanna say winter mint is what it's like. My love. Mm. Oh, too cold to swish. Oof. Okay, let's see. What do we have next? Um, I'm scared of that one. Save the ones I'm scared of to the end. Um, let's see. What is this? Brand is called Seven Stick, and it's cola mola flavored. I don't know what a cola mola is. Um, but it looks like, uh, you know, pop. So let's see. It's aspartame free, whatever that means. I want to say that's Turkish at the bottom. I think it's Turkish. Let's see. Yeah, dot com dot tr. That's Turkish. Uh, let's see. Uh, English sweeteners, sorbitol, xylitol, mannitol, malitol, syrup, circulose. Cola flavor, acidity, what is that? Oh, acidity regulator, emulsifier, <coughs> not the best. With sweeteners, und cola geschma. Oh, so there's like French, oh wait, TR, Turkish, English, German, and French information on this one. Um, no braille on this one. Also, 
I guess aspartame's a big deal in Turkey, or the lack of it. Also, the same type of packaging, easier to get out, my goodness. Let's put this on the other side of my mouth. And just plain white. Mmm. Oh, this is good. Mmm. I know, it's really good. It tastes like cola. It tastes not Pepsi, not Coke. RC, maybe? I've tasted this um, when we were in Sri Lanka. Uh, DH got a pop. It was called like CAC, I think. Um, we couldn't figure out what it tasted like. It tasted kind of like RC, but different, a little bit tangier than either of us remembers RC tasting. Um, although neither of us have had RC in you know, 20 years, so we don't know what it tastes like. Um, yeah, it tastes... Like, you know how like Coke and Pepsi, definitely Coke, just tastes like sweet. I mean, there's not like any whatever cola is supposed to taste like. This tastes more, not herbaceous, but like, like whatever, I mean, it tastes like it sat next to something natural in the past hundred years. It's good. Mm. It's really good. Not minty. Mm. That is a nice, like, I need something sweet in my mouth, but I don't want to eat sugar. Yeah, that works. Okay. I mean, the other one was like super refreshing and like my breath stinks, but yeah. Let's see, what do we have? Uh, well, I guess this is a seven stick too. We'll go for this. Um, I had to get this one because it had like Jaguars on it. Seven stick, Chivato, Dynamic. I don't know what that is, but like that's pretty effing uh, exciting looking. Uh, let's see, what does this say? Yeah, same brand, still Turkish. You're not telling me anything about this flavor other than it's dynamic. I don't know. Do you need to do that right now? That it's, you know, flimsy package. Let's see. Oh, this is only five pieces. The other two have been seven pieces. I can't remember if this was the same price. These were each like one real or two reals. So it's like 30 cents or so. Um, yeah, same wrapper. Seven. Hey, ah, ah, ah. You don't need it. Oh, I forgot to palette cleanse. Oh, wow. This is, ooh. Oh. Oh. It almost smells like cough syrup. Oh. Mm. Ah. It tastes like um Red Bull, kind of. I wonder, it doesn't say anything about caffeine or taurine. Oh, <laughs> now I see it. Mixed fruits. So I guess it tastes like the fruit part of Red Bull, not the like gross taurine part. But like the fruity part. Yeah. Not my favorite. I mean, it's not bad, and I would certainly chew it. I'm just not gonna reach for this over the last two. Now I'm gonna cleanse my palate. What? Why do you want my Pellegrino? You can't have my Pellegrino. She's super interested in my Pellegrino. Mm. Really cold, really cold. Yeah. All right, now we go to the two that I'm the most worried about. <laughs> um, oh, no, I was not aware of this. This is called Nature Dent. It's frankincense and walnut oil. It says, improve your memory with natural extract, eco-friendly and healthy. I mean, it looks healthy. That's a, that's a bold claim. 
Oh, is that a walnut? Oh, that's a walnut, that green thing. <laughs> Uh, the, oh, here we go. I have, some, I have some things to read. The magic taste of nature. Frankincense has been used in traditional and modern natural medicine for treatment of variety of illnesses. It's an oleoresin of the Boswellia trees. The main health benefits of frankincense are attributed to learning and memory improvement, anti-inflammatory, increasing circulation of blood flow, balancing hormones, and sleep aid. In spite of frankincense, several benefits benefits its taste is so bitter that cannot chew easily so we advise you nature dent to reach all these benefits and best tastes definitely not english as a first language person uh seven pieces all of that i don't know about the country there's no other languages except for semi-english um yeah i don't know nothing yeah nothing that's gonna tell me hard to get out again um seven pieces like the biodent and the boxed chi uh, seven stick the chivito no not the chivito i don't know what the deal is Ooh, this is like stickier it's um mostly plain white but has like a couple little like flex like kind of natural looking it's sticky to the touch the others were powdered like the other you know like the clips or the five gum or whatever It tastes healthy. It, it does not taste like, um, I guess I get some walnut because, you know, like walnut kind of tastes dusty. It tastes kind of dusty. It's not bad. Um, I would chew this actually. I taste a little bit of frankincense, like it smells, but it's not bad. It's like slightly bitter, a little bit bitter, a little bit sweet. A little bit dusty, tastes like medicine, but like not offensive medicine. Yeah, but not too bad. Yeah, I would do that. It's not bad. All right, now we are doing the last one. It's another seven stick. Apparently, I got a lot of those. Cardamom flavored, and that is a super popular flavor here. So I'm expecting this one to blow my taste buds out. Let's see. Again, white and powdered. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay. Peppery. Um, oh, well, <laughs> I was gonna say, oh, it calms down. No, it doesn't. Um, it's not overwhelming but it definitely tastes like cardamom cardamom tastes like kind of peppery but not hot um spicy but not tingly it doesn't burn it's actually good it's nice and refreshing um if you've ever had eaten indian and gotten fennel seeds um afterwards especially the ones that aren't candied it kind of feels like that in the mouth. Like it doesn't taste like that because it's not fennel, but it has that refreshing, cleaning kind of feel. That's quite nice, actually. All right, so yeah, this is a, is a success. Um, out of the five, I wanna say, if I was going for cleaning my mouth, I would go for either the eucalyptus or this cardamom. I would be happy with either. And if I was going for, like, I need something sweet, this is great. Um, and, like, if I wanted something to just chew because I was tired of the taste of the spit in my mouth, that, that super works. Um, I might not reach for this one again, but mostly because I don't really like, you know, mixed fruits. I'm pretty picky about that flavor. 
Um, well, glad to see this was a success. Um, hopefully I'll find some more to be able to try for you guys. Um, yeah, let me know if there's any other types of bizarre things that, that the, you know, categories you'd like me to try. I think we're, um, looking at snacks, um, kind of want to get our, transitioning our, our diets under control first uh, before we start trying to eat snacks because you know we're going to eat like at least half the bag of whatever it is. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys are having a fantastic week so far, uh, having a great day. I will see you all on Friday with another weekly update. Hey, why are we crabby? We don't need to be crabby. I don't know why we're crabby, but apparently we need to go over there and complain at the door. Don't know why. Um, hope you guys are having a fantastic day. See you Friday. I love you. Bye.